When criminals display a bad attitude during a police intervention, they often regret it right after. This was learned the hard way by a girl who became aggressive from the first contact with the police. Okay, I'm, milk, I'm not safe right here, here sir. I am not safe right now. There's also a woman who acted as if nothing had happened after causing a traffic accident. Shut the f up. Like, stop. Did I do anything? I don't want to go to jail. The one who created drama in public for no reason but first, Let's take a detailed look at a case that starts quite explosively. Employees of a bar in Ohio called the police, suspecting that a young man was dead drunk behind the wheel of a car outside the establishment. When the police arrived on the scene, they had quite a situation to handle. Hey, sir! Come on. Come on. Take your foot off the gas. Let's go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, all right? How much have you had to drink tonight? 73 to 38 is always a reference time. You need a Mac to respond? Mm -hmm. I'm tired, dude. You're passed out with your foot on the pedal and the gas accelerating. You, you, you realize what could have happened here, right? Smoked any weed today? Yes, sir. Yeah? Uh, earlier, yeah. Yeah, when was the last time? Earlier, odd. Uh, the white pole yours, too? No, that's my girlfriend. Girlfriend? She's in there. I'm sorry. That was bad. That was that was shouldn't have happened. But but if someone walked out and you hit him, man, you'd be going you're through right, a lot, you're right, lot you're, more dude, than what you're, you're right. going through right now. You understand, sir? If you weren't in park, your car would have been going across the street into traffic. One hundred percent. I please call my mom. Hold on one second. Sir. In there, dude. I'm so sorry. Okay, well here, I'll... What the f are you doing? You need to calm down. No, you need to get the f out of my car. The young man was found in a semi-conscious state behind the wheel with his foot on the gas pedal, and he admitted to drinking and using marijuana. However, he refused to take field sobriety tests and was arrested. Since he mentioned narcotics, the officer suspected that there might be drugs in his girlfriend's car and began to inspect the vehicle. At that point, Kara, the girlfriend of the arrested individual, emerged and immediately made it clear to the officers that this would be an unpleasant intervention. What the f for what? Who, who was... right now. I literally never called. No. Why the f Hey, what the f Your car. You're, you're not going to search my car. You're going to be placed under arrest for, for what? Custody. For what? Okay. Because for what? Because 
Yes, you do right not now, have my car. That's my I'm car. What's wrong with you? And I'm and I'm being calm with you too right now. You, you do, do not this, for what? What are you gonna arrest me for? We got arrested for obstructing official business. Okay? Obstructing official business. To the car for what? For the marijuana. Where? Show me that right now. Show me that. Show me the law. Pull it up on the web right now. Pull it up. Now be. I'll be calm. Okay. I'll walk away. The marijuana is in the car. There's two bags of marijuana. For marijuana? Yes. And because he was drinking and driving, the car is going to be towed. There's an open container. Okay. Where is the law that you have the right to search my car? I permission? just explained that to you. Okay, I just explained everything to you. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. I'm not going to keep arguing with you. And if you're going to continue to be like this, you're going to be placed under arrest for, for obstructing. What? Okay? For obstructing. Well, I'm making my because belongings out of my goddamn car. You can do that once we're done. All right. Go ahead. All you right. can search all my okay. pull it out right now. If you need to do this, you're going to be placed under arrest. And right. you're gonna stop. So I'm wanna, telling you right you now. I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm being calm. Yeah, right. Let's make something clear. Ohio had decriminalized small amounts of marijuana, but it was not fully legalized. Decriminalization means possession of small amounts, usually under 100 grams, is a minor misdemeanor punishable by a fine but no jail time. However, it is still illegal. If the police officers had a reasonable suspicion that there were drugs in the car, especially after the man admitted to using marijuana, they likely had the legal grounds to search the vehicle. So Kara has no idea what she is talking about, and not just that, creating a scene and yelling at the officers might also lead to a charge of disorderly conduct. I'm gonna sit, I know, I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna sit right here. I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch you search my car. You're not gonna sit right here. Why don't I have the right to search my car? Why well, don't I have the right to watch you search my car? You do, but you, you can't can. just stand over there. Yeah, and I'm gonna watch you. I'm gonna step back. I'm gonna step back. Go ahead. And I'm gonna go place back, it yeah. on video. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's, right. video. That's all I'm asking. Yeah. All right, all right. Step back against that the wall. Is that fine? So he's not, yeah. yeah, go back against the wall. Good. Whatever angle you're at, I'm walking behind you, and I'm gonna put. You're not walking. You're not walking behind me. I am that, one. That's why I explain why you'd be placed under arrest for obstructing. I literally don't have none on me. I literally don't have none on me. It Watch. doesn't matter. Nothing, you're, for officer safety, is on you're me. not walking behind Nothing me. is on okay. me right now. I want to walk right. behind We're you because you're not going to put shit on my yeah. goddamn boyfriend. He's a felon. Put your hands behind your back. For right? what? Obstruction of official business. Go ahead, because I have money, baby. We're going to okay. sue the state of Claremont but, County. But tonight, you won't be. I'm not going to sue you. Stop. You go to jail. I literally did nothing. You have no. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back, ma'am. Good. Good. We're not. Yes, you are resisting. Am I? I'm literally standing right here. Good. Where's the cruiser at? Mine's right here. Who's going to take it? Because I asked. He's in that. Because I asked to record the angle of my vehicle. No, because you're being obstructed right now, okay? Because he's a felon, so you don't place drugs on him? Because that's how you must roll? Right here. Get the Stop. Get on. Right now. Oh, so I need five men? Everybody's close. Get the while the police were escorting her to the car, she strongly resisted, and during her outburst, she hit a police officer. Put the seatbelt on. Thank you, please. Safety is very important. I literally hope your wife is cheating on you with a black man. After this drama, the police searched the vehicle and seized marijuana and pills, and Kara was charged with obstructing official business, disorderly conduct, and resisting arrest. In the following case, police received a report of a disturbance, and when they arrived at the scene, they found 30-year-old Samantha, who was clearly under the influence of alcohol. She had an argument with her drunk friend, who was behind the wheel. Samantha spat at her, hit her in the head with a mobile phone, and took her car keys. Before the officer could fully understand what exactly was happening, Samantha started to become hysterical and act wildly. Let her drive drunk. That's on you. Do you understand that she's Man, drunk? Come over here. Come back to the squad car. Come don't touch me like that. I, I don't Unless want I'm you to get arrest, hit. I'm don't touch me. I don't want you to get... I can walk. walk back I'm very here. well okay walk to back walk. Over here, like. walk back over here. Walk back over here. Walk back over here. No, not... No, no, no. You're going to walk over to my squad car. No, unless you have me under arrest. No, I'm not. I'm going to detain you for your safety in a minute here. Because okay, because I'm walk. not safe We're right here, hit. sir. Someone's going to get I hurt. am not safe right now. Give me that. Don't touch me. What Stop is it. wrong with you? Get in the car. Are you serious? You're, you're now detained. You're no, now detained. you're, you're about to be detained because you want to know something you're hurting. You're detained. I didn't do anything. You're detained. Okay, are you going to keep touching my Stop touching my 
Stop it. Then get wish. off of me, weirdo. You're so done. Put your arms behind your you back. You don't even know how done you are. Put your arms behind your back. You're resisting. Stop it. No, I'm not. I'm protecting myself. Put your arms and behind your back. And I know the sheriff right here. So keep keep touching me. Sure keep. you do. Are you serious? You're done. I don't need to do anything. Dude, what is your problem? I'm suing you. Get in the car. I am suing you if you choke Get me one more time. I am suing you. Don't touch me. Please help. Get in the car. No, ma'am. Ma'am, I haven't done anything wrong. We'll get his camera. Okay, yeah. I haven't touched him. Don't f***ing ever touch me. Again. I'm not touching Don't your wrist. Turn around. Yeah, you're gonna break my wrist now. Are you serious? Put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest. For what? For right now, aggravated battery to an officer. Oh, really? Cause to check your cameras. Oh, turn away from oh, me. Stay right here. Oh, you're gonna break your elbows. You're gonna stop break resisting. Did you stop grabbing a hold of Nick. me. Stop grabbing a hold of me. I will and put your feet in the squad you are car. Hurting me. And you are trying to hurt me. So oh, put really? your feet in the car. Have a seat. You're under arrest. What? Put your Go feet in me. the car. Have a seat now. No. Put your feet no. in the car. Have no. a seat now. I will not. Let go of my hand Let now. Go Let me. go of my hand now. Or what? We're going to put you in a, in a restraint Where device called the wrap. Just so you know, okay? We're going to put you in a I'm restraint the device. Sheriff, called I'm going to do anything wrong and I'm going to. American sovereign citizen. Have a seat the in the squad car, Samantha. Be mad. This Samantha, is, uh, have a seat in the squad car. Be mad, dude. Have a seat. I haven't done anything car. wrong. That's why you guys are being cowards and you can't do anything. Have, have a I'm seat in the, the squad sheriff. car. The sheriff's not coming. Oh, oh now she's kicking. Got her are you serious? Yeah. There we go. Really, sir? Yeah. You seem like a cut dad. Ah, uh, likewise, again. <laughs> well, no, you're not married because you're yeah, this. Because of this crazy. right here. This is what you are. Yeah. Nobody's going to come near this. Yeah. Oh, good God. I couldn't even imagine spending five minutes with you. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you're 31. You should reverse the numbers. 13. As you saw, Samantha quickly earned herself an arrest. The officer's decision to detain and attempt to handcuff her appears justified since she was causing a disturbance and posing a potential threat to herself. Several officers spent almost 10 minutes trying to calm down and push her into the vehicle, but she didn't give in and continued to resist and protest. For now, she has been charged with aggravated battery to an officer because she hit a police officer during the arrest. No, it wasn't me, but it's you're... It's all on camera! You're too drunk to know that. No, you put me in the car, correct? Because you are the one that me. Hey, I don't know what your name arrested. is. Are you gonna, are you gonna cooperate I with us? I don't know who you are, but I know that you shoved my face into that door so, for no reason. I'm the sergeant. I don't want to talk to you. I don't care. I'm the sergeant. Okay. Are you gonna cooperate with us? Yes or no? Okay, because if you don't, then we're going to take I'm you straight to county. I'm calling my lawyer. Great. We're going to take you straight to county instead cool. of... Cool. And they're going to let me out and you're going to have to do a no, whole bunch of paperwork. Because you want to know something? Good luck. I don't I don't have to say that, dude. You, I don't want My you. makeup is on I'm your car. I'm tired of hearing you talk My anyway. makeup is on your car. Okay. My makeup is on your car. So listen, I'm going to get you out. If you fight with us, we're just going to... I don't you like you. I don't care. I'm not going to touch anybody. Good. I don't need to touch anybody like you. So Unlike you, I don't do, need to hurt other people to make myself feel better. Okay. We're gonna get yeah, you I know that. But guess what? You have no other way to hold me. It's not your thing. It's just called the law, bruh. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. Right. Goodbye. 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 No, we need to get you out. Oh, you think you're so cool? No, you're not getting me out. If you could, you would have me in prison. But you can't because you're a so loser. Don't hurt me. Yep. Stop touching me! There, we go. there you go. What's your name? He... Stay right there. What's your name? Dude, honestly, this is, I'm done with this. What's your name? Have him stop what's, grabbing me like your, that. I don't know what your name is. What's your name? I'm not giving you I don't have to. I'm not right, arrested. Right. I am right. not arrested. Take care of it. All right. Search her, please. Stop <laughs> touching me. <laughs> I'm not doing this all day, dude. Because I'm going to sue the 
Adams County. Sounds I'm good. done. Put you your hand on the wall. No, on the wall. I have the wool business. Your, I actually hurting you. Put your hand on the wall. I will do that if you ask me to. I, well, you want to start again? I don't know what your name is. But. Sure. My name is Samantha. Can you you're not a... Put your put your please. please, can you just go away? Your no, officers no. have me here. No. So, look, you got to take your ring, so I'll put them in here, okay? Am I arrested? Yes. Uh, yes, you are under arrest. Oh, okay. Can, can you, you please can tell you, me what I'm arrested for? My sergeant just explained it to you. I haven't touched anybody else. Okay, let's just get through this. Can you take your rings off? So let's just get Sir, can you please take I have not off? touched anyone. Oh, okay. can you please take yes, off? Okay. but if you could tell me why. I will explain it to you as soon as you take off your property, okay? We have to get those rings off. Fine, you know? you're doing your job, I understand. I yeah. But please keep him away from me. Uh, okay, he's over there. I'm asking you to He's, over, he's over there, okay? Let's just, that's fine. I don't like castrated men okay, right, let's touching just, me. Okay, let's, uh, all the rings, okay? You weirdo creep, dude. The one right there on your finger. Look at Samantha. Yeah. This one. Hey, Samantha. Hey, right this there. One. And she's kind of hey. hot. Hey, like right there. This hey, one. That one. Why don't you like hey. talk that to her? Take this she's off. cute. Take this that off. Right there. Right, right. Thanks, guys. Yep. Except, you know what? She's a you got bigger energy than you. So you can handle that. And I cannot wait to call my lawyer. Can I call my lawyer? Yeah, you can in just a second. Give us one second. Because okay. you know that I don't belong in here at all. You must admit that at times it seems like Samantha is enjoying her arrest, which is probably what the officers thought as well, given that they were seen laughing at her statements. She keeps talking without stopping, but the officers still haven't found out her details. That's why they visited her several times in her cell, where the conversation went something like this. Are you going to read me my rights? I'm just here to get you information. I need my It's Samantha, right? I uh, guess. Your first name? Are you okay? Last name? Last name? That's your last name? Okay. You don't want to give me anything? Okay. So just Samantha. Alright, sounds good. Sounds good. Considering her refusal to cooperate in any way, the officers eventually decide to send her to the county jail. In the end, she was charged with two felony counts of resisting a peace officer causing injury and misdemeanor counts of resisting a peace officer and battery. Her bond was set at $31,000. Hello. Uh, were you just in an accident back there? You sure? Yeah, over there on uh, South Haines Street. Okay, do you have your driver's license and insurance card on me? I just need to see your driver's license and insurance card, man. Yes, so you were involved in an accident just back there. We have your drive, we have your your um, license plate, your vehicle description, you're on camera, and you have damage on your vehicle and then you just left the area. So we're just trying to get your information for the accident and then we'll send you on your way, okay? So I just need to see your driver's license and your insurance card. A woman was stopped for causing a traffic accident but is pretending to be unaware of what the police officer is talking about. She even refuses to roll down the window to have a conversation. It's just an accident. Don't turn us into something else. You were involved in an accident. You, you gotta come off of that. You gotta come off of that, okay? You were involved in the accident. We Can have to take your information. What's your first name? <laughs> don't turn this into something that you don't need it to be, okay? All exactly. let, let me tell You're you something. You're turning it into something. Ma'am, we need to take, over? I already explained it to you. you. We need your over? driver's license you and your insurance over? card, Man, or what's gonna happen is you're gonna end up going Why to jail. In this case, everything is clear as day. The woman's car is damaged, witnesses saw the accident and noted her license plate, but she continues to ignore all this and plays dumb. Right from the start, she refused to cooperate and began to complain about being stopped, which is definitely not wise when she is clearly at fault. What she did is called hit and run, or leaving the scene of an accident. This offense can vary in severity, from a misdemeanor to a felony depending on factors like whether anyone was injured in the accident and the extent of the property damage. So let's see how this will play out. We need your driver your driver's license and your insurance card for the accident report, and then we can send you on your way. If you refuse that, you can go to jail. So it's your choice. 
So I need your driver's license and your insurance card, or you can go to jail for obstructing the police. It's your call. Are you refusing to open the window? Because I think you know what's going to happen if you do that. And you don't need to turn that into something. You pull me over for what? You want me to explain it to you for the fifth time? Yep. Well, you're going to unlock it for me or I'm going to break the window. You're going to break the window? Yeah. For what? Because you're refusing to give me your That's driver's license and your you insurance can. card. That you can't. I, well, I know I can. No. So are you refusing to open your window? Okay. So at this point, you're under arrest. I need you to get out of the car or I'm going to break the window and take Why you out. Why are you pulling me over? I already explained it to her past that. What the All right. If you don't get out of the car, I'm going to break the window. So I just pretend zero with just standing around the car, okay? Yeah. Thank you. Can you turn the car off? Thank you. Can you give me your you driver's license and your insurance card? What do you think he's front of you? I'm just asking for your driver's license and your insurance card. Are you dead that serious? You finna act like that's what you've been asking me for this whole time? Well, what have I been asking Shut the you? up. Like, stop. Okay, I need stop. your driver's license and your insurance card. It's just an accident. Don't turn it So he should tell you give, then that yeah. you should give me your driver's so license. So why the entire and you what do you know if you're acting like yeah. this? Okay. Why are y'all? Why do I? Why am I pulled over right now? For the accident. Six time. Ready. You want to go six? You were involved in an accident. You left the scene. I found your car. You're damaged to the front of your car. All this is is an accident report, ma'am. Don't turn this into anything else. Don't turn it into something else. It's an accident report. We need your stuff for the report, and then you're on your way. It's your word against the other driver's word. That's all we're looking at, ma'am. I need your driver's license and your insurance card. I don't have none of that. You don't have your license, though. No. no, your insurance card. I don't card. have it. Okay, I need you to step out of the car. Why? Because I need you to step out of the Why? car. Because now you're under arrest for obstructing the police. Okay? Man, you want to turn that into that? We can turn it into that. We're not trying to make it any more difficult than you. I didn't do anything. Why are you opening my door? Right. Don't touch I'm not going to touch don't, shit, No, but you I need you to give me your driver's license and your insurance. I am, but okay. don't touch my door. Why are you doing that? I've explained it to you already. It right. don't matter. Then act like it. So you need to act, act like, like it. it. Don't touch Give me your driver's Why are you license opening? and your insurance card. Man, what a, what's up? You want to take me to jail? Take no, I don't want to take jail. Don't jail. touch me. Don't, don't step in my face. This point, just step really? to the side of the car. This is in the way. Exactly. Man. All right. You're under arrest. What are you saying? Don't, don't, don't grab my. Right I ain't driving. Stop resisting. You a dumb. Stop resisting. Ain't nobody resist. Stop resisting. You just. You, this, you must be a. You must be a rookie. Me? You must be a rookie. You must be a rookie. Stand up. Initially refusing to provide her driver's license and proof of insurance when lawfully requested by an officer could be seen as obstructing the officer's ability to conduct a traffic stop. Changing her statement about having her driver's license might also be considered obstructive or misleading as it potentially delays or complicates the officer's investigation. The officer opening the car door is likely a response to the perceived uncooperative behavior of the woman. He may have deemed it necessary to ensure compliance or for safety reasons. The woman will now be arrested and taken to the station. Is this your phone? Yeah. yeah have All right. Step up. If you want your Man. phone, step on your shoes. Yeah. That's fine. I ain't doing that to y'all. That's right. fine. Just have a seat. It stinks. Man, it's Monday. Said leave Monday. me alone. Y'all have no right to arrest me. Ma'am, you got to get in the car. Man. Hop in, let's go. Man, get me the f out of here. Y'all have no right to arrest him. You gotta get in. I'm gonna go around the other side. Right. No, you don't. Come on. Come on. You have to get in the car. Tony, you got one. Let's go. Come on. You go ahead and get in the car. Get me the f out of here. Well, you see, what you did back there is like, listen. No, what am I getting arrested? It's called obstructing the police. I mean, we can go the whole different route if you want. 
with resisting, you kick the sergeant, we could do that, but we're not, we're not going to do all that unless you act a fool down in the jail, okay? So what we're going to do, just listen to me, we're going to go to the Joliet Police Department, we have to take your fingerprints and your picture, and then we're going to release it, listen to me, just listen to me, Brittany, and then we'll get you out of here on an I bomb. we'll take you back to, or you can go sit at the Will County Jail with no bond. There's your options, okay? This started from a simple traffic stop. All right, Brittany, so we're going to take inside fingerprints, pictures, and if you're cool with that, I'll take it. Don't take me home. I promise you I will, but you got to promise me that you'll be cool with this. We just got to take your picture and fingerprints. Okay. We're cool, you're going to get every time today. Did I do anything? I don't want to go to jail. I no, we do don't want anything. you to take you to jail. This is just a misdemeanor. Okay. That's okay. Cool. Okay. So I'm not going to jail. No, this is the police station. This is the Joliet Police. Y'all promise y'all not going to put me in Look, jail. Look, you're, you're on camera. You're on camera. Okay. okay. I can't lie to you on okay. camera. was walking to the car and everything. They got into a dispute. She grabbed a hold of his neck and started choking him, pushing him up against the wall and everything. Him? Yeah, him. his shirt's all torn up. She is either drunk, she's on something, I don't know what it is, but she is just out of her. I came in here with a lot of money. Okay. Okay, he will not let me buy. I tried to buy a pack of uh, beer. Won't let me buy that. I come back with one twisted tea because I have to drive all the way over here. I've drank none. And I was going to drink it right here with my friends, down the road, one of these roads, I don't know exactly which one, literally. I think I had a problem with coming back to my hometown and saying, whoa, wow, that's where it is. So I'm having a hard time. I came here with a lot of money. They're all in on it. Y'all can have the money. I don't even know how much money I came in here with. But, hey, I would like to take a breathalyzer and be allowed to buy my beer or use some of my damn money that I'm not leaving with. Right, I need to so check my car all, how much I have some of it. All, I got that. some of it. First I got all, some of it. First of all, I had a guy pinned up against the wall. We're gonna we're gonna stay over here. You, take me. Gonna I, you ain't take me. I didn't do nothing wrong. You didn't you're not listening. Here you go. You want this? I definitely don't. The witness was correct. The suspect indeed appears to be under the influence of something. She attacked a store employee after he refused to sell her an alcoholic beverage, likely because he suspected she was drunk and could cause trouble if she consumed more alcohol. She then physically assaulted him, prompting the police to be called. Let's return to the video to see what kind of charges she will gather with her reckless behavior. And when you're in my car stealing my rest of my money that I can't get the beer. If you don't calm down. I'm not in a hard time. Cups? I have anxiety and my medicine is over there, which is why I was trying to buy an alcohol. That's okay, what it so came what down happened to. Today? I was trying to buy something else. Don't remember what that was. What happened today? What have happened had, the last had five today? years? I've had a, a, well, apparently a long year. Nothing like that. I'm on nothing. Nothing. Step back from me. I'm on nothing. I'm withdrawing I'm off my medication because I can't make my way back. Ma'am. We're not going back to the store. Okay, well, You're we're gonna. Right I want here. some of my money back. You're I, right I, I hand him a bunch of money for the beer. One pack of beer that's like I, at the most $21 or something. I'll, I'll You're finish. not going in the car. I need to check how much money you have. Yeah. Okay, you going to need to check? No. no. Exactly. Actually, don't touch my car. Look, I'm in my hometown. I drink a lot here. Here's my keys, dude. I don't want that. Actually, okay, they, I'm you. trying to get the car towed. Okay. It's not driving for you. Which is why I'm here trying to buy a damn beer. Because I have to calm down because I have anxiety. Yeah, yeah, I'm like going, going on there. Here. Dude, I gave him a right. lot of money. Okay. okay. You're, no, you're not. Yeah, you can. You can go ahead and go ahead. You don't have to burn me. I'm protecting my money. I'm protecting myself. Okay. And that's exactly what the f did. Okay. And I'll do any other All time. Right. Come with me. I'll go anywhere you say, sir. I can't breathe in here, bro. I can't breathe. Hey, I got the handcuffs off you. Hey. Now, here, right.
right now. Where the what's the address here? Here's your handcuffs. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. You cannot lie to me in here and risk my life. I'm on my medication. Please let me just leave here. The suspect claims to be undergoing therapy, and it's possible that her bizarre behavior may be the result of mixing pills with alcohol, as it's clear she is under strong influence. While the police officer was trying to figure out what exactly happened, she began to rage in the car, and even managed to remove the handcuffs from her wrists. The officer then re-handcuffed her, tightening them more securely, and she became even more aggressive than before. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're not putting me in. I can't breathe in there. You're not putting me in there. You are not putting me in. If you kill, you might kill me if you put me in there. You're going in the back of the truck. You putting me in back in the truck. I do. Sir, you have to put the air on. That's all I'm asking for, sir. Sir, step in. Sir, you have to step in the truck. You have to tell me. I'll turn the air on. Put the air on, sir. Okay. I'll turn the air on if you get in the truck. We will turn the air on. You will step in the truck. All the paperwork's in my car. I yes, I'm getting in the truck. We're gonna have problems. If I mean, you bang I, on my window again, I didn't. I had to bang on your window because I cannot breathe. If you, you bang on my window that? again, you're getting a vandalism charge. I'll Do you take understand the vandalism that? charge. You're not, foot. you're not. You're not. Are you gonna turn? Why don't you turn the I'm air on? I'm gonna tase you. Will you turn the I'm air on? I'm gonna tase you. Please turn the air on. That's all. I will. Ask, Put your feet in the truck tase me. now. I do. I'm everything. not playing with okay, you. Okay, but you cannot leave me here because you will not hear me. Please turn the air on. I heard you. We will turn the air on. This behavior led to the woman being charged with battery, resisting a merchant, resisting a law enforcement officer without violence, and petit theft of stolen property valued at less than $100. She spent 30 days in county jail.